Here in Nebraska, we have sharp tail grouse and we also have the greater prairie chicken. The thing that appeals to me about prairie grouse really is the habitat they occur in. Uh, prairie grouse are really an iconic species, a, a species of the past per se. Hunting them, you really get to experience what the way it was at one time. You gotta have enough grass out there, obviously. In areas like the sand hills, everything looks relatively the same, good quality cover, but you know, you wanna have kind of that mid-height grass. You don't wanna be in something that's so thick where you're really having to pick your feet up. They're typically in kind of those less dense stands. So finding areas like that is usually what I key in on. In other parts of the state, a lot of times with season-long grazing, you gotta find areas that have been rested or deferred from grazing for part of the summer. And that's where you're gonna find enough cover to hold those birds. Throughout much of the range, you can kind of get the odds in your favor by hunting some areas with a little bit of topography. So a lot of cases I'll look for the areas in the sand hills where you have more of that chop. You have that uneven ground where you can, you know, sneak over the tops of those areas. You'll have blowouts at times uh, on the other sides of those ridges. And a lot of times can kind of provide a sneak attack on those birds. A lot of times they're gonna be tucked in just on the other side of those ridges, either in the shade or also uh, protecting themselves from the wind as well.